Oh, Arts first. We didn't get to talk about this yesterday because we had to talk about tornadoes that were confirmed, but it was the sixth coldest November on record for Springfield. You can see lots of blue filling in the calendar here. We had 22 days below normal and eight days above normal. Uh, so if you do some of that number crunching, 22 out of 30 days below normal is 73% of the month. Plus we had 16 out of 30 nights that were below freezing. That's 53% of the month with those morning temperatures below 32 degrees. Again, that makes it the sixth coldest November on record. The monthly average was 39.7 degrees, over 6 degrees below normal. The record coldest November was 38 degrees back in 1951, so we were about 2 degrees shy from that top spot. But it was the coldest November since 2000, and our records go all the way back to 1888. So again, it was a pretty cold November here in the Ozarks. 27 degrees this morning, another cold start. It's 29 in Rowla and 30 in West Plains. We've got mostly cloudy skies out there this morning. A couple of flurries up around Rowla, Lake the Ozarks and Clinton possible as we kind of get nipped from a weak system that's up to the north, but it would be a few flakes and should not impact the roads. We've got high pressure to the west with that clockwise rotation. That's pulling a north wind into the Ozarks, and that north wind is keeping these temperatures suppressed. Cold air lingers today on that north flow uh, on that uh, right side there of the high pressure. So temperatures again are going to stay cold yet again. We'll possibly make it up to freezing. 34 degrees for that high. Average is 48. We'll keep mostly cloudy skies again today. Temperatures in the 30s with the cloud cover, the cold air, maybe some clearing later on in the day. So we'll keep the clouds, especially up to the north and to the east, starting to clear to the south and west first. We'll have temperatures in the 30s area wide today. More clearing overnight with temperatures in the 20s. And then tomorrow, the Best day of the week. We'll have temperatures in the middle 40s, still below average, but warmer. Lots of sunshine and a south and west wind. The next big storm that we're watching arrives on the California coast by Wednesday, Thursday, and then we'll track through the southern plains and be to our south by Saturday. With this low tracking to the south, that will keep us out of the hair of severe weather, but it will keep us on the north side or the cold side of the low. So that's going to wrap around cold air and it's going to change rain into snow. So it's looking like for the Ozarks, snow will be likely as we head through Saturday. Now I know the next question is going to be okay, well, how much snow? Too early to tell. We'll have some dry air trying to come in from the north with that cold air, which could uh, pose a steep cutoff in some of those snow. No totals. So if this tracks a little bit farther north or a little bit farther south, you're looking at these snow totals being very dependent on that track. For right now, it looks like the southern half of the Ozarks has the best bet at accumulating some snow. But again, this could get tweaked a little bit farther north, and then we're looking at more snow accumulation for more of the area. So long story short, you got to stay tuned to the forecast. It does look like snow will be likely because of that southerly track. Timing would be Friday night into Saturday, too early to make a call on snow totals, but you want to stay tuned for those details. Always pay attention to when we've got snow in the forecast, but we're paying extra close attention because Saturday is the Christmas parade downtown in Springfield. Looks like for now 33 degrees at the very least cold with some of that snow likely. 34 degrees today, cold again with some clearing late. 24 overnight, decreasing the clouds. 46 tomorrow, warmer sunshine, the nicest day of the week. Light drizzles and flurries possible on Thursday. And then we'll have that bigger system come through late Friday into Saturday.